else what's happening y'all well today we're doing errands we took the dogs up to uh the groomer and uh <laughs> and uh so now we're washing clothes and doing our daily stuff we're washing clothes and it was the funny thing when we went up to uh take the dogs up to the groomer it's a new groomer we never used them right we never used them before I, I, the groomer i use here couldn't get us for three weeks felix yep so this place looks like it just opened up so they probably they had, don't have a lot of uh customers so they took all the four dogs even even though they were covered in black cinder dust i mean the dogs walk around and they get to baby may may <laughs> took off baby may may took off running uh, yesterday, uh -huh. it's like little poof. Every time she hit the ground, little poof, like poof cloud, poof cloud, poof yeah. cloud. Yeah, Fox is the same thing. She kick up the dirt, and she's she's just a sponge. She's just sucking up the. She's a dirt ball. Yeah, nasty yeah. dogs. Tumbleweeds don't got nothing on Foxy, but nasty. they were all nasty, all nasty. And um, so we call up the uh, Kevin calls up the lady and and arranges for the groomer. So. We show up today together, um, together in, in his RV because I can't ride Miss Gypsy because of the uh, sealant, the, the leak. Got a pin, got a pinion seal leak in the rear end. Right. When we uh, when we left Flagstaff, I put the camera down uh, on the road. We drove over it. Wouldn't have been for that. We wouldn't have known that rear end was leaking for nothing, Felix. Probably everybody seen it in his video seen it. There's a lot of comments on it. That'd be, you know how much that would have cost. If that rear end would have uh, went dry, my RV days were over. If that would have been, been five, six thousand dollars, yeah, yeah, it'd have been a penny. Yeah. Um, but anyway, you can't. He can't drive his. No. It's, it's close to the shop. We're about a couple miles from the shop. We're going to risk it. Right. Um, I'm going to try it today, maybe in the afternoon. Go underneath, see if I could put some. Uh, just put more gear more on. More gear it. on at least, because uh, if it breaks down, and that's five, six thousand, that's it. My RV days are over. So anyway, we get to the place, and we both in this RV. We show up with these four fruit fruit dogs. <laughs> and, and, and people, they were looking at it. Yeah. So they we were, go they inside. Were, they were real nice. Yeah. Real nice people, right? But they were. They were. We went inside with the fruit fruit dogs. The girls are looking at us. You know, two guys in an RV with four fruit fruit dogs. I tell you, we're traveling. We're just traveling through, and we, right. we're in this area a lot. And we, we need a good groom. We're looking for a good groomer. Yeah. And I noticed the girl was looking at me funny. <laughs> and the other girl was looking at you funny. And you got yeah. a foxy lady. And she's all laid And she's asking me, how do I want foxy? Is you're on a line cut. So, well, this is a girl dog. You give me a feminine cut. You know? Give me a girly cut. And she's looking at me. You know, they're all looking. I'm like, you know. Looking at me, too? Yeah. So, you know, it's a girl dog. Give me a girly cut. So, anyway. We didn't figure it out. No, no, we're, no. We're, we're back in the RV. We're going out driving down the road. I'm like, Felix, something ain't right. <laughs> <laughs> so when we get back, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to uh, set, the record, uh, set the record straight and let them know. You, you know what? You know what? <coughs> Excuse me. This, this is the truth. I'm straight. Mm -hmm. Felix is straight. Mm -hmm. But if we wouldn't, if we wasn't straight, it'd be a perfect relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you know it just <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it don't work. It don't work. You know, you know I don't want hammering. So okay. <laughs> so anyway, so when we get back, it's gonna we're gonna set the record straight. So I'm gonna try to see if I can film it <laughs> and let them know. We're not far from it. No, we're not far. And uh, we gotta go pick up your van today. I gotta go pick up the van. The lady's supposed to come Tuesday or Wednesday. We gotta. We and gotta... I gotta go pick her up in the airport here in Sholo. We got, a, we got a good, safe, private place to stay. Yep, yep. To keep it, nobody bother us. So I go clean it up, do my thing, and I change that fuel gas filter. Fil fuel filter. And uh, and I said, have it ready for her. She might, she might travel with us for a little bit since since we headed up to New Mexico. So if she travels with us, I could teach, you know show her how to work the. Uh, the tent and, and, and you know the heater and show her show her the ropes because I don't think she knows much about RVing. Now I'm not we're not judging nobody. If 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 this works for you, that's hey. not that's none of my business. I don't care. Uh. But uh, I love women. I have I have I had a weakness for women my whole life. I like sushi, the other kind of sushi. 
Mm. <laughs> well, anyway, well, 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 you can get away with that on your channel. You know, I can't say stuff. Yeah, hey, PG, PG. Shit, man. So anyway, we'll 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 be back on the uh, on uh, when we go pick up our dogs. We'll see if I can film it and put the record straight. Let me see and put the record straight. We'll say this man straight, this man straight. We just happen to have frou frou dogs. Yeah, we don't treat him like he, he kind of treats her like a frou frou dog. Yeah, yeah, she's a girl, so yeah, I cut like, her like a girl, feminine. I, I treat mom like tomboys. Yeah, because of martini. And let me tell him about the we took Tucker to the vet. And I hadn't made a video yet about this. I uh, took. Give me a second. Felix's arm got tired, and so he's gonna have a little, uh, little uh, transition right there. Yeah. But we took Tucker to the vet yesterday and had his blood work run because he was. We were up there in Flagstaff, and when uh, our, our friends Frank and Tammy, they had a Rhodesian Ridgeback, and Tucker didn't want to play. Yeah, yeah. And he's not wanting to walk with me, so I called up Doctor Despain, the guy that saved his life. And uh, he said, you need to get his blood checked. So anyway, we were in Snowflake. We got his blood checked. He said his numbers are great. That's good. That's good. So if you don't catch it on uh, you know, my channel, you, at least you see it here. So uh, thanks to Dr. Despain and Tucker's going to be okay. We'll get this laundry done. We'll go pick up the babies. Y'all come with us. All righty. See you in a little bit. Laundry day. No way around it, right? No way around. So we're gonna go into the uh, to the groomers. So we're gonna have to <laughs> straighten some stuff out. I had to sneeze. Oh, you had to sneeze. We got a lousy cameraman today. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay. That sneeze sounded a little... Some of them there. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you wish. Look over there. Oh. Take a picture? Yeah, I'll take a picture. Is that okay to take a picture? This smells like crazy. Pretty cut. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh. You good, baby? Yeah. Yeah. He's foxy. And we cleared it up, guys. We're not gay. So, so we cleared it up with the girls here. <laughs> So we got everything cleared up with them. Baby's got a good haircut. Nice people. It's yeah. a good day. I had some Chinese food. Oh man, mm. that was good stuff. We didn't went, listen, we didn't went to like the last four or five places we went out to eat. I'm like, why do we even why yeah. do we even try? Some places. Why do we even try? Went to this a Chinese restaurant in, on the Indian, basically on the Indian reservation. They Good had stuff. a they, they had a menu that thick with pictures. Must, Must have been over fifty pictures in there. There's more than that. Fifty per page. It's probably 20, 20 pages, fifty per page you of all it. the menu, all the stuff they cook. It's been a good day. Very good day. All right. The next update will be on the van and the um, Miss Gypsy. And uh, I'll get, see you guys. Get that pinion seal fixed. We're gonna get yeah, yeah, we're going to get that fixed. Look how wet it is. What? Uh, what? What? No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> how wet the... Well, oh, you oh. know. 
I'll okay. see if I can get you the clip so you can see what we rolled over. Yeah. So I went and picked up the van. Uh, me and CVK took her out. Getting it cleaned out, getting her ready for the new owner. I think she's probably going to be here maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. Uh, and uh, so I'm going to get all cleaned out and get her ready for her new owner. Foxy's haircut. Where you going, baby? Hmm? And people say she's fat. She's not fat. All that hair she has. The last walk around. <laughs> Go Foxy. She's like, this is my van. What happened? The last walk around. Felt good driving her. Sure gonna miss it. Sure am going to miss it. And the good thing about it, the lady Puerto Ricans, I can keep my Puerto Rican stickers on here. So she look in the inside, bare and all. So I gotta clean the inside and vacuum and put it up real nice. Hello, son. Come here, baby. Let me show them how you look. You look so pretty. Yeah. Um. Uh. You, 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 you love me? Mm, yeah. Oh, you do. You love me? Mm. <gasps> You're going to get them, babies. My goodness. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. Peace. Forrest Gump wave. <laughs>